But one thing that bothers me on the like a little side note was I was thinking the, the guy says, all right, well, four of us will stay behind and fight off the Cardassian while the rest yeah. of you flee. I noticed that number one, there was no argument of who the four would be. I thought like, the same thing. <laughs> Did people just fall asleep? Was it already pre-established eight years ago? They're like, if we're ever going to see, you're yeah. the four that are going to yeah. have to fight. Because if I'm 10 years in the labor camp, I'm yeah. leaving, guys. I'm not sticking behind. Uh, I'm, no. I'm not going to be like, yeah, you guys go ahead. I'll, I'll fight them off and stay behind. Uh, no, I, I, I'm like, no, uh, you two stay. I think we can or, do or you know what? What if you're one of the 12 and then we're like, okay, we're going to escape. And this guy, this jerk goes like, hey, four of us will hold you. You're like, you? we're getting the- who, who, who are you to decide? Yeah. Who, Why not two? This Why not three? Why not three? Why how, about you, you? how about you fight them yeah. off since you're so ready? I'm going to go. Yeah. The other thing I noticed was when O'Brien leaves, he doesn't leave his phaser with one of the four guys who got left behind. You would think yeah. he would say, here, you take this and cover us while we run to the ship. <laughs> Instead, he no, takes O'Brien's his- like, I'm going to need this thing when these guys <laughs> yeah. get shot down in about five yeah. seconds. <laughs> so four guys with one phaser, you know, so it's really not that effective. Uh, and then I didn't see any drawing of straws. The four guys were like, yeah, we'll, we'll stay, we'll stay. So that was funny to me. Uh, and then the other thing that I thought was funny, because, you know, if I'm in that moment and I was literally watching it and in the moment thinking, what would I have done? What I would have done was left two people behind, arm them both with phasers, mm-hmm. and then as I'm leaving, beam the last two people out because I can only beam two people. You nailed it. You're right. Right? So that would, like, just like as a, ma- a matter of practicality, that's how I would have approached that particular, in, you know, scene. But, uh, you know, all in all, I think what the real message was behind it. And, you know, I don't know if there's any one particular message when you watch these shows. There's, they're always layered with these different contextual messages, messages here, messages there. Um, you hear that, uh, you know, the writers are always thinking about conflict. Mm. And so, you know, there's going to be conflict throughout a Deep Space Nine episode. That's pretty much a guarantee. Um, whether it's conflict between characters who like each other, like Odo and Quark, or conflict between people that don't like each other, like uh, Gold Ducat and Cisco, you know, and kind of this, this, this way. I love that scene uh, with Ducat and Kira, though. It was super short, but everything that Mark Alimo does as Ducat is gold, and every reaction that Nana gives back to him is so layered and so good. Like when she just stands there and she watches him and listens to what he's saying. And you can tell she's just sitting there going like, what's, what's your game? Here? Yeah. BS. What, My BS what, meter is just yeah, going ding, ding, off ding, the ding, charts ding. right now. Yeah. And she's just like looking at him like, okay. And Cisco turns. He's like, yeah, I'm surprised too. I had no idea. He's saying yeah. this kind of stuff, but, but let's go with it. Cause it sounds pretty good for us. Um, but that was a short scene, but it really had impact, you know? It was still great, yeah. And here, Mark Alimo is not even in the room. He's on a computer screen. I was thinking the same thing. That is hard to act. You get one scene in a, in a room with a, with a wall, <laughs> yeah. and you're just acting, and he's still got like that. He's just oozing with that he's, Cardassian yeah, ego, just, you know? Just, so good. Uh, it's so good, and he's, he's so good at it. 